Knowledge is practical. How do you develop a medication? How do you navigate Build an Build a house. Build a house. That's fine. Knowledge is important. Wisdom tells you whether or not you should do it. Wisdom is eternal. Wisdom does not change. What's up, YouTube? Hope you guys are feeling good. Today, guys, we're back again with a new video. Today, we're going to check out how to have real value in society. Just kick and Candace Owens. Okay, this is going to be amazing. This is Life Free Tour um, in the Tony Points USA. So let's check this out. Hi. Um, so my question is, you guys um, were discussing blue collar workers and how they have a lot of wisdom, which I certainly agree with. I'm sure they do have a lot of wisdom. However, um, your guys' perspective more so sounded like they essentially have more wisdom or more knowledge than someone in academia. And my question is, why do you guys believe that blue collar workers and people um, in these laborious jobs have more knowledge than someone in academia? And is that rooted or what, how, how is that factually? rooted so I guess I would say rather than saying wisdom I would say that they have more real-world value and currency than somebody who's writing papers trying to transform the world from a classroom and I, I genuinely believe that I believe that sure. there is more value in learning to work with your hands there's more value in learning how to raise productive human beings I I hate the fact that women are being sold a bill of lies and being told that we should be competing with men and wanting to run executives of you know fortune 500 companies I, I believe that we absolutely flourish in our feminine roles and that the toughest job in the world is being a stay-at-home mom and raising good children um, so to me when we shifted those values and we stopped realizing that these people actually have the most value to society, in, in society, we watched our social decline begin. And we have essentially True. been within a it's managed window. social decline for the last 60 years, in my opinion. I, I would add to that. Um, anyone has to take a sociology class or anthropology class here? Yeah, um, have a kid. You'll learn a lot more about human beings than anything a textbook can teach 100% you. 100% true. Experience always is going to override true. what you can it, learn it, in a book. By the way, I would say you conflated two words, knowledge and wisdom. They're not right. the same thing. Not. There's, a, there's a lot of knowledge here at Ohio State University. There's not a lick of wisdom in most of these classrooms. And <laughs> what is the difference? Very simple. Knowledge is practical. How do you develop a medication? How do you navigate Build an Build a house. Build a house. That's fine. Knowledge is important. Wisdom tells you whether or not you should do it. Wisdom true. is eternal. Wisdom does not change. Wisdom is the knowledge of things that will be true 200 years from now, and they were true 500 years before, because you're dealing with the same raw material. Human beings do not change. We are broken from nature, and it takes effort to create good people. Hmm. Fat. <laughs> Experience always beats knowledge. It's as simple as that. There's different knowledge and wisdom. I just, it's, it's, it's fat. Someone who is studying in school, writing, uh, da, da, da. those are theories. The people who are practicalizing practical, it life, they're doing the practicals. They are different, like I'm in us. Um, a doctor can just come from, let me see, just graduated, now he's a doctor. Okay, they've given him his license. He comes to the hospital for the first time to come and practice his stuff. A nurse who has been there for... 10 years or 20 years has more experience <laughs> and more wisdom than the doctor who studied for probably 10 years. <laughs> you get that? So experience always beats knowledge. The simple as that. So you find the doctors coming to meet the nurses that have been there for a long time. Say, How are you guys doing this? How is this? They, they kind of like want to get to know how everything happened. And they are also trying it out themselves to experience it. You just don't, because you have people's degree that you are a nurse or you are a doctor, you just come to the hospital and say, yeah, let me start doing, nah, you have to build up. It's growth, you have to build up. Some, some doctor's hands are still shaking. Some nurse's hands are still shaking because they are those freshers. You get, so, Experience always stand out every time. Experience stand out. It's like a man who is a computer and he has been doing this for 20 years and someone who studied about carpentry just come and say, I, I can't do this more than you. No, it does not work like that. You see, someone who has experience always beats them. It's, it's fat. It's how life works. Even before we're born and after, where we're going to go.
So this was an amazing video and I love how Candice Owens handled it and I love how Charles Kick also handled it. This is intellectual answer. <laughs> They're very, very smart. I love that. I love the answer. Like it's as simple as that. Fat. So guys, comment down below what you think about this video. Give us a thumbs up. Share this video as many as you can. Subscribe to our channel. I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you stay safe. I just bought a bag like an old lady. I'm back wood smoking. I don't own papers. Pass that 808. That don't, don't shake her. Oh, bitch, you know I'm grinding like a pro skater. Baby mama bugging. I'm so quick to hit ignore. Buku bitch, you in my bed. I got scales on.